everyone know that before we even start this, sorry, I already hit record by, by the way, but I'm like, hey, Mike, are you ready? And he's like, hold on. He chugs his beer and like almost tosses it out my fucking wall. So that's the state of my we're in today. That's how, that's how you know that I'm ready. <laughs> and you have to be. Because right. it's like 2 a.m. We've never done this. In, it's, when are our normal times, it's either like in the midday or like afternoon. Yeah. Or like early, early evening. So we're playing Dear Esther. I'm playing finally. Yeah. Because man. I haven't played for a while. It's true. So when we started this channel, we're like, um, we're like, Sal's gonna play. Sal's gonna play everything. And I'm just like, step over, bitch. And I'm like, but. I'm sorry. That's that's rude. I don't want to insult female dogs. Step over, Sal. <laughs> Damn. Oh, burnt. It's even oh. a worse insult because <laughs> it's me. <laughs> so, yeah, this is gonna be a very different. Yeah, let's just yes, let's just, just get into it. Let's jump into the water naked. Oh, that's right. I said beat this game. Uh, no, just I game. didn't see anything. Yeah, right. Best game ever. Just <laughs> a fucker. I was like, so Assassin Three, Two, fuck yourself. No, this is my favorite part. Like, <laughs> I, I wonder if more dots are gonna. Oh, I wonder. Damn, what a twist! It's it's going in a straight line, Mikhail. Dear Esther, oh, okay. the morning after I was washed ashore, salt in my ears, sand in my mouth, and the waves always at my ankles, I felt as though everything had conspired to this one last shipwreck. I remembered nothing but water, stones in my belly and my shoes, threatening to drag me under to where only the most listless of creatures swim. Remember the graphics game over here? <laughs> <laughs> Not to downplay the game, but yeah, did you know, here's Sal's little trivia coming into play. Tell me. Oh, did you see that ghost? I didn't see a ghost. Oh, okay, cool. I missed it. Oh, what? Oh. Hmm. Slow-mo ghost. So, um, in this game, this was originally a Half-Life 2 mod. Really? That, that, that it got so popular, they were like, fund it! <laughs> Interesting. And then, yeah. So also in this game, in, and for so often... Was it funded by Valve, then? No. Oh, but, okay. Yeah, it's not, it's not in the Source Engine, I think. Gotcha. But, uh... And Mike's also probably wondering why Sal playing a game looks creepy. It's because it's, it's, it is, but it's not. We should go ahead and, um, like, we should go ahead and just pause to, like, stop moving. Yeah. Like, for no reason. End the recording. Let's look and see how fucking dark this looks. Gotcha. Yes. <laughs> we'll be right back, because, um, Penumbra. <laughs> Which was so fun. You just spat all over my right hand. I masturbate with that, Mikhail. I don't yeah, want Well, now you have a lubricant. That's why I have Shibari, though. Idiot. I don't need to hear about your girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> we just had, we just had to record it. It's pretty fucking great. Yeah, it looks good. Wait, come on. Game? Well, no. Oh. Game? Yeah, yeah there, there we go. go. <laughs> Let me make sure. We're pros. Dude, we're... I am amazed we are not rolling in the monies right now. I, I am, too. So, also in this game, there are, I think, 12 ghosts. And watch this. Wait for it. Oh. Oh. Um, you always see them. I, I usually in your periph. Right in the periph. Okay. So, oh, what's this shit? This is weird. Right? What's this? It's Equations. Kindergarten bullshit. In like paint? That's fucking Finger weird. Painting. I forgot how creepy this game was. <laughs> um, by the way, guys, uh, if anyone's like or worried of, of um, jump scares, there are none. I played this game, so I, I, I. <laughs> Other than that. That actually really scared me. Um, other than Mikhail being a fucking douche canoe sailing down shitbag river, there will be no jump scares. What are you talking about? I didn't do a thing. Mike, please. It's 2 a.m. Don't do this to me. I'm so fucking tired. You're... Oh, all right. Hey. Oh. I also like how your guy like dips down. Like, okay, no. Like, how about we don't with that? Don't mean you. Don't you mean your girl? Is it a girl? Esther? Esther's oh, yeah, a girl's sorry. name. Sorry, I forgot that. Sorry, um, I'm a, just a misogynist pig. My Tumblr is salvatorehairinthetumblr.com. I guess technically you could claim that I'm the misogynist pig because I claimed a name was sex-based. Damn, dude, we're problematic like, as like, fuck. High five. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fuck that. Oh. There we go. He had to, like, switch hands for his Technically, beer. my name is Michelle. Yeah? Like, Michelle. It's French. Just fuck that noise. Oh, I'm Mikhail. I forgot about all this. This is so cool. Mikhail. Also, sometimes there are a few ghosts in here that you can only see. 
if they're in your periphs of the other... So, this is gonna sound like a fucking insult. Keep playing the game. Okay. Uh, but a lot of this game looks like some, uh, some models I did in college. Like, a lot. Like, the texture style is very similar, so I'm digging it. Yeah? I don't know why I said it was going to sound like... I guess because I was like, when I was in college, I made this game. Yeah, but but we all forget that you're fucking going to be good. <laughs> yeah, I'm all right. Dude, I love your shit. <laughs> oh! Oh, more paint. What's all that right. here? Ooh. Oh, it's... what is this shit? I love... This is very... This is, like, like basically Sound Hill the Room. But no, like... I've heard very mixed stuff about this really? game. Really? Okay, like, whenever I first played this, I fucking hated it. I mean, this game would be played in two hours, and back then when I played this game, I was a fucking snob. And <laughs> I played it, and there's no shooting, there's no there's no bad guys, there are no dialogue trees. Wow, no... way to ruin it. And so way to just spoil it. After the two hours, I was like, that was the most bullshit fucking <laughs> game I've ever played. I, I ship better games than this. And then I thought Damn. about it, and then I thought about it, and I was like, that was one of the most brilliant games I've ever played in my life. <laughs> because it's such an experience that, well, like... It's, it's not like you can't watch a film that has nobody dying or jumping off yeah, trains, and, which isn't uh, great either. I know. That's the thing about being a snob about games, is that you don't get that. No, I spent a long time as a media snob. I'm still a media snob to an extent, but at least I know it, and when, I, when it starts happening, I'm like, Hey, uh, Mike, how about you take your head and you pull it out of your ass? <laughs> Just for just just long enough to take in a whiff of fresh air, and realize that things are gonna be okay. I also love when games do this. What? Where you're like, huh? What's that? I'm just gonna zoom in with my eyeballs. Mm -hmm. wait, 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 wait. Do it again. Hold on. Yeah, ready? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> I never got that in games where it's like your eyeballs zoom in. Wait, your eyeball? You can't do that. Can you, are you fucking cyborg? Yeah, they like pop out a little bit. Yeah, do it's they? Like, it's like the end of uh, Who Framed Roger Rabbit. Oh just my like, god. <laughs> when we met before, I sounded just like this! <laughs> Sorry, neighbors. So during my stream today, um, for reference for those who oh, watch those, it was uh, part 11 of my Neverwinter Nights stream. My upstairs neighbors were just fighting and throwing shit over and yelling, and I was like, Yay. Like they do. Yeah, they do. Have, haven't you called the cops on them a few times? Mm-hmm. Because I was legitimately worried that someone was being murdered. Yeah. Yeah. And it's funny because... It's not funny. It's not funny at all. No, I'm... I'm There was once up. talk oh, of a oh. wind farm out here, away from the rage and the intolerance of the masses. Hmm. The sea, they said, is too rough for the turbines to stand. They clearly never came here to experience the becalming for themselves. Personally, I would have supported it. Turbines would be a fitting contemporary refuge for a hermit. The revolution and the permanence. I'll gladly bathe in this man's voice. Right? That is, some, that is a nice... Well, I know. It's time for next time. Oh, shit, is it? Next time on Joss and Possum. Well, poopy. I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens next. Yeah, man. Wait, is it? Yeah, whatever. Fuck it. Well, no. Just a puzzle. So I like in some of the recordings uh, where sorry. I... That's fine. I'm, I'm just, not sorry. Let me just double check. I always double check because I'm a fucking paranoid idiot. But I love, oh. this, I love this, some of the recordings where, like, I hit start record, and then as I'm saying, Jonathan Blossom! But in the, uh, in the recording, it's Awesome Blossom! <laughs> I was like, That's Blossom. not our name. That's not... Oh. Ooh. Is it the Golden Ratio? All right, so you want to hear some bullshit anime bullshit bullshit? I want to hear some bullshit anime bullshit bullshit. All right, so when I was in college, I had this group of friends. And we'd hang out all the time. And we were like, we're going to be friends forever. Yay! And so there was this, uh, the waterfront beach by our house. So one fucking day, we're just swimming in it. We're hanging out. In the Willamette, by the way. And if, if you if you know where that is, then you know you're not supposed to swim in it. Wait, say that again? The Willamette. 
In what state? In uh, Oregon, Portland, Oregon. Oh, okay. It's like really polluted and gross, uh, but we, I didn't care. So we, we were just hanging I out and swimming. I found the ship's oh, manifest oh crumpled and waterlogged under a stash of paint cans. It tells me that along with this present cargo, there was a large quantity of antacid yogurt bound for right. the European market. It must have washed out to sea. God knows there are no longer gulls or goats here to eat it. <laughs> Goats. He's so mad. Yeah, he's just, oh. But continue your story. So, I, I stopped so that we have yeah, more time. Yeah. So, um, we're hanging out there all day. It's like really nice summer day. And, uh, at the end of it, we're like, man, I love you guys. And they're like, I love you too, bro. And then we're like, <laughs> oh, all right. I forgot it was <laughs> touch touched screen. the screen. It just went crazy. So, there was a we ended up like drawing these symbols in the sand. And then, like, Drawing on our hands like fucking Yu-Gi-Oh style. Oh Jesus! With a sharpie marker and putting our hands together, just be like, "We'll be friends forever." I have not talked to those people in Ever like since. six years. So, Mike, um, yeah. it's I, terrible. I, I, there's card parts here, right? All right. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Can you turn on your light and go look at those? No, you can't turn it on. Oh, it turns fuck. on automatically. All right. Well, if you can't see that, then there are car parts. Yeah, there's like a tire and like what connects the tires together. The axle. Yeah. Thank you. Sorry. Yeah. Dude, I know. I know three types of. I know four types of cars: big, little SUV, and truck. <laughs> <laughs> well, I broke them. <laughs> like how offhand that was too. Oh, I really wish you'd said that with like your deep Southern accent. I know. I know four types of cars, right? Big, little, SUV, and truck, right? <laughs> okay, yep. Yep. Mm hmm. Earlier today, like. <laughs> <laughs> Earlier today, Mike comes home because he went out shopping for, uh, for stuff for a film we're working on. Top secret bullshit. Um, and Mike would, like, terminate me if I talked about it, so. I'm gonna fucking kill <laughs> you. <laughs> I'm a fuck, and I don't mean that in like a cute. Ha, ha, I'm a cute. I will stop your heart if I talked about it, right? And I'm not going to. But he went and, and got stuff. But he got, he got like these things to put around like tires in, in the winter for the snow. And I was like, what are them? We don't have no snow in the south. <laughs> we don't know what them little white flakes are. We always thought that God was just scratching the dandruff out. Is that not what it is? Up in the Bible Belt. Up in the Bible Belt. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, by the way, this game is very, like, Sound Hill 2 symbolism, so you'll follow it. Yeah. That's why I pointed it out. Like, when I play Sound Hill 2, and you're like, look at the butterflies! And I'm like, Th that's cool. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, no, you're not looking. <laughs> you're not looking. Look harder! <laughs> Sorry, I'm looking. Where are they? Where is it? <laughs> oh, hey, leaves. God, this game is still pretty. I'm digging it. It was prettier when it first It doesn't came have out. that annoying first person indie game Bob going on. A wonderful sight. <laughs> the moon He's cresting like, yeah. the junction of the like path of <laughs> the stone circle. It cast a shadow of the ridge across the beach, all the world as if you had signed your name in untidy handwriting. Nah, man, that fucking indie games that are first person love to do that the way like, over exaggerated Bob, and I'm just like. People don't walk like that. Unless they, like, have, like, I can't even think of a net. Like, what? <laughs> Maybe if they're walking on pogo stick feet. <laughs> no, they're, they're clearly wear. I get it. Everyone in those games is wearing, they're wearing moon boots. Moon shoes! Moon shoes! Moon shoes! Jump to the moon! It's a necessity! <laughs> you knew that. Way more than I did. <laughs> I just always thought that was an amazing lyric. Jump to the moon. It's a necessity. Someone had died or was dying, or was so ill they gave up what little hope they could sacrifice. They cut parallel lines into the cliff, exposing the white chalk beneath. You could see them from the mainland or the fishing boat, and know to send aid or impose a cordon of protection. And wait a generation until whatever pestilence stalked the cliff paths died along with its hosts. Hmm. My lines right. are just for this. To keep any would-be rescuers at bay. Whoa. The infection hmm. is not simply of the flesh. Oh? Alright. 
So we're finally getting some plot going on. Are they attacking your Oh, cells? see, there's the chalk thing, kind of. It's harder to see because the graphics are a little... But, yeah. Dude, I, I love this. Sorry. <laughs> it's so refreshing to play a game on Joss and Possum that I fucking like. Damn. Because we've been playing some bullshit, Mikhail. <laughs> <laughs> oh? Are you saying that Alone in the Dark was a... I'm saying Alone in the Dark was progressive and needed to happen. But it still sucks. <laughs> so it's like the first wheel that was made. Yeah. It's like, yeah, this is cool, but how the fuck do I actually get up this hill? That's cool, but Steve's making a better one than... Like, like Steve... Well, like, thanks for getting the idea, but... Ew. <laughs> the first wheel was just a square. <laughs> I feel like that'd be, just be a square. Huh? I wish we knew how the wheel was made. Like, the original idea and concept of the wheel. A mostly so ate a donut. little to recommend them. <laughs> I have now spent three days in their company. <laughs> that is, I fear, enough for any man not born amongst them. Despite their tedious inclination to quote scripture, they seem to me the most godforsaken of all the inhabitants of the Outer Isles. Mm. Indeed, in this case, the very gravity of that term, forsaken by God, seems to find its very apex. Are we in the sound now? <laughs> it appears to me that Donnelly too the found Bell. those who wander this shoreline to be adrift from any chance of redemption. Did he include himself in that, I wonder? Hmm. So there's some religious folk here. And I think maybe someone kind of joined them from whatever ship may have crashed or May or, or may not here. have. The alleged ship. Yes, the alleged ship. <laughs> um, and by the way, when I make that, 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 when we do that doofy southern voice, we're not making fun of, I mean, not really. Like I Sal is southern. Yeah, I'm like, I, I, most of my life is, from, I live in the south, and I have a lot of friends who talk like that and are really awesome people. It's just a stereotype that's funny. But like, yeah, I have friends who talk like that and they're some of the most amazing people. Like, I don't, I think that southern people are dirty. Okay. I? <laughs> <laughs> I don't really, yeah. I don't believe that. Um, some of the nicest people I know are like really deep southern. I was married to a southern girl. Really? Mm -hmm. Married? Tell that story. I never... just, a, just an ex-girlfriend. I had beautiful blonde southern girl who we dated for like a year and uh, it didn't work out. That's fine though, cause now you're gonna... uh, she's a fucking. I know my uh, um, st status. My girlfriend bleep because we don't say her name about the show. Oh right, gotcha. <laughs> but aren't you doing the anonymous? That thing with the anonymous girlfriend. Oh, she's a moose. Yeah, <laughs> she's a moose. Yeah, you. I don't want to hang out with her, but the night makes me. Oh. Who's mean? He's mean. No, but uh, like she was really smart and like she was really cool. It just. Whoa. She's kind of... Did you see that? What? Right there in the very middle. It kind of blinked for half a second. Are we seeing more goose? Oh! Oh! You saw that, right? I saw something. Let's, get, let's keep walking. Oh, oh it could have been the blaze. Oh, the, the splashes? Ah, oh, damn. Fucking salmon. <laughs> <laughs> the look you just gave me. I so, love... Are you fucking kidding me, bro? I love living in Washington, because I ever walk by like a salmon river, I'm like, hey, man, Esther, it's for me. I met Paul. <laughs> I'm <laughs> salmon? My Damascus, a small semi-detached on the outskirts of Wolverhampton. That's a nice name. We drank yeah. coffee in his kitchen and tried to connect to one another. You're not Legos. Although he knew I hadn't come in search of an apology, <laughs> reason, or retribution, he Up still top. spiraled in panic thrown high and lucid by his own dented bonnet. Responsibility had made him old. Like us, he'd already passed beyond any conceivable boundary of life. Hmm. What the fuck is happening on this, yeah, right? <laughs> this, this island, right? Yeah. Okay. I didn't want to... I didn't, I didn't want to sound like a fucking idiot. Not an idiot. It is exactly next time. Oh! Rule. You fucking nailed it up top. My hands are hurt so hard after this. <laughs> you can high five and yeah, let me just focus. turn this lion ring around. So you, yeah. Up top. I'm gonna go down low. <laughs> <laughs>
again. Okay. I'm enjoying playing an, an interesting, fun game. Like a chill game. Yeah. And I'm enjoying <laughs> playing a game that isn't um, fucking stupid. Ooh, ouch. Yeah, I love this. Uh, it's also, um, uh, did you know, I found this out when the very first time I played it, because I started the game, and I heard the little intro thing, but then I was like, oh shit, I have to do something. And I think I accidentally skipped the intro, and I was like, fuck, I didn't want to do that, so then I just restarted the game. Mm -hmm. Different intro. Really? And there's diff yeah, there's apparently different, like... So you can act so the replay value doesn't come through, um... Wow, this sounds diggy. I'm going to change the way I'm going to say that. It doesn't come through interaction, but through uh, the way the story is delivered. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's interesting. The first thing I was going to say that was going to sound so fucking cocky. Yeah. And stupid. No, I knew I knew what you were going to say, and I'm glad and, you changed And that's it. not what I meant. Yeah. Oi! Whoa. What? What's going on? Oi! Why are you playing this this walking simulator? Whoa. Oh, you're doing a thing. <laughs> <laughs> I was like. Why are you screaming oi at me? Like... I was... Fuck off here. Fine, I'll get out of here and I'll go play something else. Alright, goodbye. So we can keep going that way, or let's go this way. Let's get in the fucking dark cave. Okay. Always worried that we can't see shit. I find myself increasingly unable to find that point where the hermit ends and Paul and I begin. We are woven into a sodden blanket, stuffed into the bottom of a boat to stop the leak and hold back the ocean. My neck aches from staring up at the aerial. It mirrors the dull throb in my gut where I am sure I've begun to form another stone. Oh, wow. In my dreams, it forms into a perfect representation of Lot's wife, head over her shoulder, what? staring along the motorway at the approaching traffic in a vacuum of fatalistic calm. Oh, I'm hmm. Wait, so, okay, so this is a Half-Life 2 mod, you said, but it's not made in Source? Originally it was a mod, but then it got so popular that they were getting Okay, so the it. story was the mod, and then they just made it. Mm -hmm. Do you know what engine this is in? I think it's a new one. I know it's for the Chinese room. Damn, okay, good. Mm. Mm. All right. Why? Just, so. no, I'm just like, you guys fucking stepped up your game since yeah. Penumbra. <laughs> Or is that after? No, it's not them. That's that, 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 that's, that's... I thought Chinese Room did for number. Nope. That was Frictional frictional Games. Oh, okay. I thought you had told me that the person who made Penumbra made uh, Machine for Things. They did. <laughs> yeah, um, the guys... I thought made... that was Chinese Room. Only the first one. Only the first Amnesia. Uh... So what's this? Well, it's clearly Nern Root, and you need to pick it so that you I'm can... not hearing a noise, Mikhail. <laughs> Edit in the noise. See? There it is. Oh, yeah, you're right. So you gotta pick it so that you can make an invincibility, invincibility potion. That doesn't exist. That's called turning off the game and going to work. This is cool. Uh, uh, so, so this is this fucking chemistry shit that I'm seeing? Yeah. Okay. Because I'm recognizing some of it. and I'm like, Yeah, what are you recognizing? Let me know. Because I, I, I didn't ever take chemistry. I don't know it that well. Okay, cool. <laughs> I don't know it well enough to tell you, at least not at like 2.30 in the morning, oh, but yeah. um, I, I know I've seen it and my mind was like, that's chemistry. And we need to cook. So I'm about to say it, as what Walt says. Uh. <laughs> that'll just be the gap. <laughs> no, I don't get that, it's fine. <laughs> the gap's a store. I love the gap. Did you know that um, the people who, uh, like, the company that owns The Gap also owns Hot Topic? <laughs> <laughs> For everyone listening and not paying attention, that was a visual joke. You can rewind it now if you don't mind. Instant replay. No, but yeah, uh, The Gap owns, is, is the same fucking company as Hot Topic. That is fucking insane. <laughs> Look how Dasani also does coke. It's like, are you serious? Yeah, they know what they're doing. Oh, that's kind of cool. Dasani, by the way, sounds like a car company, I'm just saying. I'm looking at that boat. What is that? Is that a boat? Yeah, oh, a boat. it is. No, oh, it's kind of small. Is it made for two people? <laughs> Fucking shit. I love force feeding. It's like, <laughs> get it? <laughs> hey, guys. Like, fuck it, pay Wait attention. A Wait a minute. Well, that's fucking trippy. What? Didn't we come in this way? Jesus Christ, Sal. <laughs> <laughs> The sad part is I didn't notice until you fucking shoved it down my throat. Mm. 
All right, so you got my attention. Uh, uh, you Didn't know you come in that way? Wait Does a the flashlight come on, on on its own? Oh yeah, it's automatic. Interesting. It's whenever you need it, really. Okay. Do you do a full loop around? Loopy dee loop. Oh yeah, you do. This music is fucking rad. It just very cleverly hides the fact that you're going in a circle. Nice. Yeah, um... Golf clap. Yeah, Jessica Curry composed the music. And she's very good, and I want to work with her. I wish I could play the violin. But you have a violin? It broke. Oh, shit. I so I can't even practice. I remember, like, you got it, like, the week I moved in with you. Uh, and, uh, like, the first time I just fucking shredded it, it just destroyed. Wasn't that when I was, like, going to visit someone? Yeah. yeah. And I did. I fucking played Stairway to Heaven, and it was beautiful. It made, like, one single tear come out of every child's eye. And now here's Wonderwall. <laughs> I don't get where that joke came from, and I don't get the joke, but it's fucking funny. Like, I don't understand it. I just laugh. You are the only person I've ever met who has the balls to say, I don't get this joke, but I'm snotting out my nose laughing at it. I, I mean, I'm just an honest person. I beat my fucking tongue out. I'm sorry. Ouch! E. Uh, <laughs> Ouch. Ouch. I think I went outside the barrier. I'm back. Oh, My tongue does hurt now. I'm sorry. It's okay. I should have to talk for the next he hour. He still maintains just, oh, he wasn't drunk, but tired. <laughs> I can't make the judgment or the distinction anymore. I was drunk when I landed here, and tired too. Right. I walked up the cliff path in near darkness and camped in the bay where the trawler lies beached. It was only at dawn that I saw the bothy and decided to make my temporary lodgings there. I was expecting just the aerial and a transmitter stashed in a weatherproof box somewhere on the mount. It had an air of uneasy permanence to it. Like all the other buildings here, erosion seems to have evaded it completely. Hmm. <laughs> like, I love how it kind of like slowly is like, hey, here's a little bit of story for you. Figure that out, bitch. Hey, okay. What's this Stonehenge motherfucking bullshit? Yeah. Oh, more fucking uh, yeah. chemistry. Yeah, it's definitely chemistry. I don't know why that, what I just said it kind of reminds me of that, uh, in the scene in Gone Girl. Like, go back home, slap at your penis. There's some wood for you, bitch. <laughs> reading that, like, because I'm reading the Gone Girl shit right now to learn how to do really good screenplay writing, because I think I'm shit. Reading that, like, on paper is really weird. Because, like, you're like, you feel like that, that, that line wouldn't work, you know? Well, okay, so the first time we watched God Girl, like, one of my favorite things about it was that I was like, in the beginning, I was, I was like, dude, this dialogue is bad, it's weird, it's wrong. Yeah, like, it feels kind And of... you were just like, whatever. Like, yeah, I, I guess I just, I guess I was just so engrossed in the visuals, I was like, whatever dialogue, fuck you. But then, like, the fucking movie turns, and then as soon as you, oh, fuck, you realize, I, do I really want to fucking ruin Don't, God don't Girl? spoil it. Whenever the twist happens... Yeah, like, eventually the, the story, it becomes clear that the writing is the way it is for a reason. And then as soon as that happens, it changes. Yeah, and immediately it just... And then it's, uh, and then it's real as hell. In and one, it's in, like, oh, okay. In, in, in one of the best cinematic reveals, like, ooh, it's so good. It's okay, they saw the Gone Girl spoilers thing come up on the screen there. All right. Like, before we even talked about it. Oh, thank God. Like, they're good. And if they're still watching, even though we said it, then, um, I'm sorry. Did you hear that? I heard a little... Hmm? Oh, that was, that was the wind. Yeah. That's what they want me to think. <laughs> <laughs> I, I did this douchey look and now, the now right it's time for next time on Justin Bottom. Shit, I don't want to stop playing this game. Well, then we won't. We'll just keep playing it and they'll just have to wait a day to see it. I love you guys. Like, I would, I would give you a soda pop and take you to dinner and give you a nice wink. Um, I, I want to call you back, but, uh, I'd say I would. that hello i'm fat yeah we're fat
<laughs> we, we both just like sat down and like unbuttoned our pants like simultaneously, just kind of going. Ugh. We both had that like old man side. Seriously, that, like, I was just in the bathroom. I was looking in the mirror, and I was like, I had this one scraggly chin hair, and I was like, I'm gonna get you later. <laughs> I always pick up my chin hairs. Very oddly. I like, whenever I'm like bored or just chilling, I just pick at my at my at my facial hair. That's unfortunate. And my eyebrow hair. It's like a nervous habit. Hey, shh. <laughs> hey, hush up, you. I'm trying. Oh, hey now. All right. Um. Into the dark. With I you. feel like before we go down that uh, that um, un, go backable. <laughs> It's 3 a.m. Help me? <laughs> uh, no, I like ungo backable. Yeah. That's good. Because you can't jump in this to, game. No, no that's a word. The definition to not be able to go back. Ungo backable. From the Latin. <laughs> From the Latin? <laughs> the um, Latin what? <laughs> Tell me. Incombatible. Incombatable. Incombatable. There you go. God, I messed it up. It's okay, dude. So we're just going to check out this area before we move on and see if we can go up anywhere. Because I don't want to go over there before I, I know I can't go anywhere yeah, else. Yeah, it's uncombatable. I'm never living that one down. <laughs> What's going on? History. But, yep, that's the way I have to go. Alright. I think the game is, like, explorative enough, but it's also, like, enough... It, it guides you enough. Does that make sense? No. Like, there's enough little ways to go, uh -huh. but you always know which direction you have to oh, go. I get you. Oh, like some guys where it's like, oh no, this road's blocked. It's like going to the bus stop, but I mean, you know, you could go down the street and still get there. <laughs> what the fuck, man? Dude, what was that? <laughs> we're tired, but we're so happy to play this that we don't care. I'm happy to play playing a game that doesn't make me go, well, um. Walk through. Like, fight the fucking pirate. <laughs> I guess. Throw knives at it for five hours. Uh, yeah, fucking Assassin's Creed Black Sail. I'm sorry, what? No, that's not what I was talking about. I didn't mean that. Ooh. Oh, damn. I haven't played that it's game. It's not like it's just a rehash of all the other games on the EC or anything. Whoa, whoa. Who is saying that all the Assassin's Creed games are exactly the same? That all the, that, Oh, man, who is talking about that? That's crazy. It's not true. I hate Assassin's Dear Creed. Esther, it's fucking true. <laughs> I've now driven the stretch of the M5 between Exeter and Bristol over 21 times. But although I have all the reports and all the witnesses, and have cross-referenced them within a millimeter using my ordnance survey maps, I simply cannot find the location. You'd think there would be marks to serve as some evidence. It's somewhere between the turn-off for Sanford and the welcome brake services. But although I can always see it in my rearview mirror, I have as yet been unable to pull ashore. So you can't find the place that something happened on some sort of highway, I guess? Or freeway? That's weird. <laughs> Is this annoying? I can stop. No, it's fine. Oh. You're just kind of like, so, we're making macaroni and cheese, and it's weird because you got to put in the fucking cheesy powder, like, sometime, maybe, to make a cheese. All right, Mike. What? You see this little ridge area? Yeah. Keep looking at it. Let's see our first ghost. Is it the little woofy 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 woo woo thing? So, do you see it? Okay. I don't see shit, son. Oh! See that? Alright. Yeah. yeah, yeah, put a pointer. Oh, I did. Yeah, cool, thanks. And, yeah. Also, wait, let's see if we can get this, this again. So, there he is, right? Mm hmm. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's, oh, oh All right. I, I guess it was nothing. What? Wait, what is that? <laughs> oh, it's nothing. Shit. What is... Oh, am I going insane? <laughs> yeah, you can only see it in your periph. Like, it's... It, I love it. You're not allowed to look right at him. It's like, it's like a ghost... It's like... Uh, I, I, was about to say, I was about to say... It's like a ghost in real life, but that's not true. It's, it's, it's just... It's like uh, the sun. You can enjoy it, but don't, don't look, look at right it. At it. <laughs> I know he runs along this thing. I'm trying to. Where is he? Shit. I lost track of him. 
bitch. Where are you? Oh, whatever. Fuck you. It's hard to see it with all these, like, little cartoon ghosts floating around the screen. Oh my god, did you just do that? Yeah, Look I, at them. I, They're I, everywhere! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Whoa! Whoa, alright. I love doing that. He touched the screen again. <laughs> it's fun. <laughs> Shit, there's a fence! <laughs> that was the most forced joke ever to appear on the show. I don't know about that, man. But maybe. That, that is true. We we, we, we we do force it sometimes. A little too hard. Like, make him, make him bored. A little bored. Make him bored. Impossibly. Alright. Well, that's... That's good. <laughs> what is this, Uncharted? Is that anything that happens? Yeah, they like a lot of... Um, they like to do a lot of stuff where they... Uh, well, like, put a machine in a place a machine shouldn't be. Like a submarine in the middle of the forest or something. Huh, wait, what's. Uncharted games are fun, we should play those. I wonder. God, what's that? Oh, son of a bitch. <laughs> what the fuck is it? I, I guess it's. <sighs> <laughs> Darn. <laughs> oh, nuts. I, I love that. How, like, because you know, like, when in real life, whenever you're walking and you see something in your periphery, but you don't quite know what it is, mm -hmm. it's interesting how they, how they kind of utilize that. Because another game would have just had you look at the ghost, there's like a jump scare, it's like, Whoa! but this game is like subtle. And Subtlety like, is nice. And when I first noticed it, my skin started to crawl, and I was like, am I going fucking crazy? So you mean not like um, true crime stories? Because that was a really subtle game. Oh, real horror stories and limited. That's what I meant. What, Ultimate is, what the fuck is true crime story? I thought it was like, I was like, we well, haven't seen NCIS lately. <laughs> That game was really subtle. Oh, criminal Minds. Yeah, no, that game was bullshit. I'd be up for playing uh, some Condemned. Um, it's a silly game. Yeah, you can play it. I'll just sit off to the side. Not Condemned 2, you know, Hobo Fighter Simulator. <laughs> I've heard you compare it to that. <laughs> you know, because you punch hobos a lot. Oh, what's that? See, there's finally a light. What is this, Great Gatsby? Dying light. Oh, he kind of moves a little bit. Hmm? Just chilling. I love that. I tried, I tried running up to him once and he's not there. Even if you look away, he's not there. Yeah. Like, if you get too close to him, he just is not. Oh. There must be a hole in the bottom of the boat. How else could new hermits have arrived? Well, well they're... The hermit crabs? Those are supposed to infer. Oh, what's this shit? I love this game because it's like, what's this? What's this? There's something on that rock. What's this? What's this? There's a ghost over there. I thought you were going somewhere else. Hey, how does it go? <laughs> yeah? <laughs> Do you want to go there? Because no, I don't. I'm... Yeah? Are you, are you I have set. Like, yeah? I'm a baby just sleeping in the stroller. Like, just leave me alone. <laughs> Okay, so now we're gonna go over there, then we're gonna actually move on to this area. Alright. If you explore all there is to see, you get like the most story. Okay. Because, you know. Story. Whew, I'm getting tired, but that's fine. Narrative. Narrative! God. But yeah, I do hate I do hate when games like don't know what subtlety is. You mean, like, any, uh... <laughs> Homecoming? <laughs> you mean how, uh, there's no real survival horror anymore, because they forgot what that meant? Oh, it's, damn. Shit, son. No, that's not true, though. It, it exists again. For a while, it didn't. Oh, boy. They go to the ghosty. That's why I fucking love, in, like, a great indie game that actually, you know, isn't trying to appeal to the highest common denominator. <laughs> Denominator. Yeah, the reason why I like indie games a lot is because they, they're not restricted by the by the AAA publishers. And I'll be I'll be honest, like they don't all fall in that category. Obviously, of like, hey, we're just trying to make a good piece of art. Some of them are just trying to be a AAA game. Oh yeah. And uh, but without any of the assets of a AAA game. And I've uh, begun that's to wonder if Donnelly's <laughs> voyage here was as prosaic as it was presented. How disappointed not to have found the bones of the holy man. No wonder he hated the inhabitants so. Hmm. To him, they must have seemed like barnacles mindlessly clinging to a mercy seat. Why cling so hard to the rock? Because it is the only thing that stops us from sliding into the ocean. Into oblivion. 
I shut fucking the love the term the mercy seat. Dude, there's a lot of good writing in this. Like earlier when it's like like, like the um the forming a uh a pit in my lungs line. Mm -hmm. uh, I was like, thank you, come again. <laughs> <laughs> it's weird because the ghost is like right there, but maybe you're the ghost. Damn. Fucking dropping. Bombs! Bombs! <laughs> I like how the guy said the line like Patrick Stewart did in Oblivion. Bro, shut the jaws <laughs> of Oblivion. And you played that game for the first time like a few months ago or a month ago, yeah, right? Yeah, something like that. Yeah. And you've been playing Skyrim for a while and you never played Oblivion. Yep. It's interesting to me. Skyrim was my first Elder Scrolls. It's weird to me that, that people, that that's their first. Because yep. my first was uh, Morrowind because, you know, hipster snob over here. <laughs> yeah, my first Elder Scrolls was, uh, was uh, Morrowind. I didn't I, even know about Elder Scrolls until Skyrim, really. That's so fucking weird to me. Probably just because it was a huge part of my childhood. Yeah, I so, just, I didn't know. And, I, I, I'd seen my friend Dan in college play Morrowind once but I never really gave it much thought yeah I guess it's weird to me because it was so vital to how I became like a, a storyteller and my ideas in game design and yeah. how I did things the here because when I hear people be like oh Skyrim yeah and, and they don't know the other ones I'm like that's weird yeah I had no idea but that's just me being a fucking snob and me liking to go in order I don't even know if it's necessarily being a snob you played them when like, they were new Right? Yeah. Like, at first, so, yeah. yeah. Like, that that's like me saying, like, well, I was playing Metal Gear back when it was Metal Gear Solid. Like, well, I guess I'm a snob. Like, that's not necessarily true. I've I never played the original. And you visited me oh. in the hospital. After the operation, <laughs> when I was still half submerged in anesthetic, your outline and your speech both blurred. Now my stones have grown into an island and made their escape, and you have been rendered opaque by the car of a drunk. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. all right. Yeah? <laughs> I was... <laughs> oh my god, that was so... I had, I had to have the comments on it. <laughs> so... Me and Mike have a certain... Um, it looks like this. We do that. Yeah, this is footage of us <laughs> doing things. So I did that to be like, I put my arm and I was like, kind of like time. And then he went to go do the thing and I was like, no, you fucking don't. <laughs> like, you big dummy. Like TikTok, I'm motherfucker. Sorry, I'm a dummy. What's down here? Infant. Whoa, all right. Oh, all right. This game was not made for Hey, yeah, whoa, whoa. Oh, what's this shit? What charnel house lies at the foot of this abyss? How many dead shepherds could fill this hole? That's a fucking line. Well, that's a fucking good line. <laughs> Sorry, you that's a fucking good. You rave line. about it until uh, next time on Jessel Bosom. Oh, you saucy fucking bitch. Yeah. <laughs> Hot sauce. <laughs>
What's your thing? <laughs> I know he walks eventually. Get moving, you. Oh, whatever. But isn't this fucking pretty? <laughs> like, oh, I want to film here. It's so fucking hot. <laughs> Sorry, I, I get a boner for scenery. I just get boners. I've been known to have a Coffee few boners. Was the yeah, he's worthy right in the now. early 1700s. Yeah, man. He, By then, it. shepherding had formalized into a career. The first habitual shepherd was a man called Jacobson from a lineage of migratory Scandinavians. He was not considered a man of breeding by the mainlanders. <laughs> he came here every summer whilst many, building the Bothy, hoping eventually that like becoming Vikings, a man of property would secure his wife and a lineage. Donnelly records we that were friend who was on Vikings. he caught some disease from his malcontented yeah. goats Extra. and died two years after his Extra awesome. There's no one to carve white lines into the cliff for him either. Hmm. I'm glad they came back. It's funny um, how some people say either and some people say either. Um, also how some people say um, both or both. Both, yeah. Well, I, every once in a while my, um, my more, uh, my ghetto roots will show. And uh, my, my uh, <laughs> inner city accent will come out. And I'll say ambulance. Is an ambulance. ambulance. Actually, that's like naturally. If I'm just talking, I'll just say ambulance. Also, some people say caramel and caramel. Yeah, but, mm, I'm a caramel person. I don't give a fuck. I don't care either. It's just I know what. No, I'm I saying. don't care. Okay. <laughs> I'm glad we're friends. You know. <laughs> I think I'm a caramel person. Are you? I don't think I say caramel. Yeah, you are a caramel. Yeah. I'm a caramel. Oh. Yeah, we're friends. I love you. I love you too. I love you. Whoa. Oh, all right. That was shocking. Yes. My heart is landfill. Oh. These false dawns waking into the still never light. I sweat for you in the small hours and wrap my blankets into a mess. I have always heard the waves break on these lost shores, always the gulls forgotten. I can lift this bottle to my ear, and all there ever is for me is this Hebridean music. This game has great fucking lines. <laughs> As if my heart is landfill. It's like ooh. Oh, this game is so cabin. Sorry, I I, I drip off of this game. Yeah. Hey, what's in the trunk? Oh, it's not even the trunk. It's a suitcase. Yeah. What an asshole I am. Dude, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Whoa. Oh wait, were, were you in the bit? What? Did, did, did I ejaculate you? No, you just came out like, mm, bro, ow, <laughs> growl. <laughs> I am growl. That's cool. Oh, the birds still flying. It's so sweet. <laughs> so I, I'm in love with this game it's so hard. <laughs> so I know we have to go down there. So I'm gonna go over here. <laughs> All right. I love, I love. Uh, I don't know. I'm very explorative in games. I'm always like. Oh, that's the right way to go? Dude. So let's not go there. I actually really am too, when I'm just leisurely playing games. Oh yeah, uh... And I hate thinking I'm going the way that the game doesn't want me to go, but it actually is. And then I know that I should have went down the other hall. And, yeah. Right? Oh, what's this? This isn't, this isn't chemistry. This is... It's like directions, almost. Huh. Yeah. Hmm. An Eero. There's a lot to pick apart. I, I, I kind of... After I play this, it makes me want to look up theory videos, you know? Because <laughs> there's different like ways this game is played. And... Oh, what's this? Um, oh. Sorry. My dick just went inside of itself. Didgeridoo out of here, huh? Mm -hmm. Go away. Yeah. Mm. See, and that's so cool. It's just... It's such a small detail that, like, you don't see on the main path. Because mm -hmm. the main path for this area is go up the thing, go through the house, go downstairs. Downstairs. Down, down the pass. You have to go over there. <laughs> but they put a thing there. Like, thank you. <laughs> like, like, instead of us just kind of going there, like, oh, I guess it's another house. It's like, what was that weird rock thing? What was that noise? No, it's... It, there. There is a whole, um... 
There's a whole art to making your game world feel like it's much more alive than it actually is. Yeah, I want... Uh, Not alive. It's maybe... No, I guess alive, more expansive, but, too. And just, also... Uh, yeah, it's also feeling as if, like... It's not just the path laid out for you, you know? Yeah. The world has... The world is alive. It's breathing. It, it People have done things in this world that aren't important to you. Like... In a footnote, the editor commented <laughs> He's just like, point, shut up. Donnelly was going insane <laughs> as syphilis tore through his system like a drunk driver. Oh. He's not to be trusted. Many of his claims are unsubstantiated. And although he does paint a colorful picture, much of what he says may have been derived directly from his fever. But I've been here, and I know, as Donnelly did, that this place is always half imagined. Hmm. Even the rocks and caves will shimmer and blur with the right eyes. He kind of sounds like Obi-Wan Kenobi. Like Alan Cummings, Obi-Wan? No. Or uh, Ewan? Yeah. All right. Nerd. <laughs> I want to do a Star Wars movie, like one, like if Disney ever gets drunk enough to give me the rights. Like I want like one film. It's so weird to me to remember that Disney owns Marvel and Star Wars. Yeah, and also, um, you and I, our series, are part but, of the um, are part of the studio. You know, they have stock in nuclear weapons. We let that fun on Jossum Possum. <laughs> And talk about only happy things. Uh, bananas are fun. Oh, look, there are things on the rock. Sorry, this game's just so happy. I like how it's going on a random... They found Jakobsen in the spring. <laughs> Thor had only he just come. <laughs> Even though he'd been dead nearly seven months, his body had been frozen right down to the nerves and had not even begun to decompose. His fingernails were raw and bitten to the quick. They found okay. the phosphorescent moss that grows in the caves deep under the nails. Whatever he'd been doing under the island when his strength began to fail is lost. He'd struggled halfway up the cliff again, perhaps in a delirium, perhaps trying to reach the Bothy's fire before curling into a stone and expiring. Hmm. All right. God, you know, I was already so happy that it made me happier. <laughs> I did. I was just full of joy. I was trembling with joy. Trembling with joy. <sighs> I don't know if that's. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go fishing. Yeah. Go get some salmon. <laughs> Anything to say about this? Whoa. Oh, it's a rock. That was a thing. Well, the rock is a thing. No, like a living. Fuck you. <laughs> Nothing to say here? Oh, come on, dude. I'm not gonna sit here and take. It's like, it's water. <laughs> <laughs> Island. <laughs> Car crash. <laughs> it was that not obvious? Because it was pretty fucking obvious. Well, you said it. Yeah. Yeah. Good. Well, he. Well, I guess he didn't just come right out and said it, but he still said it. Yeah, come on, guys. Not that I'm judging if you didn't get it. I am. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm, like, I just want them to know. I I'm like, judging them. It is funny, though, how much I love them and you hate them. I don't hate them. You just think they're filthy. Yeah. <laughs> Next time I draw some possum. Really? Is it? Yeah. That felt short. Are you right? Now I'm the asshole. <laughs> By the way, I'm just saying. Yeah. I'll wait till we start. Okay, let me just do... Because now we get to do this little ditty. Definitely. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Mike sucks dick. JK, I love you. It's true, though. Ha 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 Okay. Cock, 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 cock. That was a penis laugh. Do you have a... Timer, or do you want to look at that? Absolutely. Okay. Ready? Yep.
Johnson Possum! It's been like over a month. Yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> you guys, it's been like a day or two. But... Yeah, they don't know things. You don't know. We're in a completely different place. We are, we moved. Like, my hair is green now. What? My skin, a fuchsia color. I, I, this isn't even my final form, though. What the fuck? <laughs> so we haven't, like, recorded in, like, months, like, anything. Like, not just Dear Esther, but everything. Like, nothing's been recorded. And Except for my yeah? sex tapes. Okay. Is that true? <laughs> <laughs> Is that true? So you're, are you serious? Is that honest? So you're about to say something, and then you're like, oh, wait. So what are you going to say? Oh, I was just saying, uh... The NES, the retro game library is getting kind of sexy. Dude, it's been growing. Like every day I walk in here to go do it's something. It's like a little I'm bit like, more. What the fuck? So Mike's been like just collecting old games. I, I... Jacobson's rip page, oh. they told <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to fucking it's <laughs> Jacobson's rib cage. My bad. Brittle and overblown it was, and desperately light. Perhaps it was this that finally did for him. Yeah. Unable to right. contain the shattering of his heart. In half light. <gasps> His skeleton had started <laughs> a calcified seabird. Okay, so I'm gonna raise the game volume, but <laughs> explain yourself and why the fuck you're laughing. It was the way that was written. I'm sorry. <laughs> Unable to stop. It, or what was it? In, in case the breaking of his heart. <laughs> I'm still okay. in fucking audio. Like, hey, mellow out there, bro. <laughs> like, just a little oh, bit. Oh, my God. So, um, also. It's the first time we're recording audio separate. What we used to do is we would record it in tandem with the actual game, like in the same file, but now they're recorded separately, so if there's any mistakes, my fault. Yeah. Blame Sal. Yeah, blame me. I do. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, man. You were going to say things, though. Come on. Say Sorry, Mike. What, what am I saying? I do. Fucking before we were going to say words. Oh, wait. Oh, the NES. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> Blame Sal. Blame Sal 2016. I don't mean to do these things. I do. I'm sale, sorry. Sal for fail representative 2016. Uh, Did I say sale? You said oh, sale. I blame you for that. What? Because my name is so close to fail that no, you just, just blame me for the fact that, that you fucked up? Always blame Sal. Fuck you. Spill some milk? Blame Sal. Oh. Oh. Jacobson. Jacobson. had only just come. Take a sip of my drink. Even though he'd been dead, he got a little flummy. Right That's unfortunate. He looking for some lost goat, or perhaps in the <laughs> into a claw, right I like that that's his first. Even the animal shunned his corpse. Oh, damn. Thought to bring it home He's filthy. Let's not eat him. Man, you're getting... When the goat is just like, nah. I mean, I know you feed me and everything, but you're ugly. <laughs> we might have done this bit already, but I don't care. I don't remember. I forgot. I knew we were at the house. I remember rocks. So I apologize if we're... Okay. I apologize for nothing. So so Mike emailed me like a week ago, and he's like, we're doing Joss and Possum again. And I'm like, I love you. And so then... We were going to record yesterday, but I forgot it was his birthday, and, I, and we were both like, eh, <laughs> let's not do that. It was the birth, my birthday and the last day that the anonymous girlfriend was in town. And I didn't know that was, a la that was her last day. Yeah. <laughs> I, I found, because I went to Brooke, and I was like, so we're not recording today. And Brooke's like, oh, are you okay? And I'm like, no, I wanted to record today. I mean, I know it's his birthday, but he, he knew that, and he still wanted it. But, and then he didn't want to record it. And then Brooke's like, well, the moose is going home. It's her last day. And I'm like... I'm the asshole. <laughs> and then I got even sadder because it's my fault that I'm a jerk. That's great because you know me well enough to be like, he shouldn't care about his birthday. He never cares about his no, birthday. No, exactly. I'm like, I'm like, so when he says, this is just an excuse. So when he said we're recording Monday, I'm like, oh, it's his birthday, but am I just give a shit about birthdays? I, I know. But it's the last day the moose was in town. <laughs> It's like this man. What a jerk! It's like, well, you know, his girlfriend's going back to school. Like, I'm the jerk. I had no idea. <laughs> so then today he's like, hey, I'll be home at five. Have it ready when I walk in the door. It's six and he walks yeah. in and he's like, blame China. I... <laughs> so you have to explain yourself. Why yeah, blame China? Just, just blame China. 
No, okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> You're uh, fucking dead. All right. So um, the Chinese saying. president uh, <laughs> arrived in uh, Washington this morning, and so. I complete. I knew that he was arriving, but I completely forgot. I, I know <laughs> and then, that. basically, the thing is, every time he goes somewhere, and of course his itinerary isn't up because that's unsafe. Uh, so, <laughs> well, it is. Like, I know. A diplomat it's... comes to another country. You don't like be like, "Hey, I'll be at the I'm Gap at twelve. Man, better avoid Fifth Street. <laughs> <laughs> so, like, all right, I'll let him talk. Clearly infected. Oh no. His skin has turned a bright, tight pink. And the pain is crashing in on waves. Man, Jessica Curry, the is just like fucking with a washboard, like, yeah. <laughs> I struggled back to the brothel to rest, but it has become clear that there is only one way this is likely to end. The medical supplies I looted from the trawler have suddenly found their purpose. They will keep me lucid for my final ascent. So apparently, this guy washed up the shore, he crawled over But what happened to the goat? I want to know yeah? what happened to the goat. Well, anyway, so yeah. every time that the um, the president, he goes somewhere else, uh, they just shut off, like, they cut off the streets, and, like, they shut they shut down a bit of a freeway for, like, half the day, and so traffic was just crazy. I got a good nap on the bus, though. Well, that's good. Yeah. Well, I was sitting here just, like, on my phone, like... <sighs> Though I, um... A uh, European lady. I don't know where she was from. She sounded Slavic, or uh, she. I don't think she was Russian. But anyway, she she yelled at this guy because he like asked if she, he could sit down and if she could move her suitcase. She just starts screaming at him, and he's just like, "What the fuck? Why? Like, okay, I'm sorry." <laughs> oh, I thought it was a person for like half a fucking second. It, it wasn't though. And thanks, Kyle. You're welcome. Yeah, I'm here for you. But from here, like at a distance, it was like. What are you? I just wanted to be a goat. They mentioned a goat, so... <laughs> you were so out of it. Yeah. A goat. <laughs> <laughs> that was the most shy goat sound. Like he... there, here he goes. <laughs> <There's him. laughs> it's weird because you're like legit pointing to the other side of the room and I'm like, what? what? Yes, yeah, it's right there. Oh my fucking <laughs> So this is also weird because we're, we're at a new setup. We're not at like a really... A, a, we're not really at a desk. There's a desk. This is... Yeah, it's a little desk. Yeah, yeah, it's a bitch desk. What's wrong with it? It's big enough for it's everything. It's tiny. I don't like it. I like bigger desks. Well, I'm sorry. So deal with it. Mm. <laughs> and we can't record in my room, which... Oh, by the way, we moved into a townhouse. We went from, like, a one tiny one-room apartment to, like, a three-bedroom, yeah. two-story townhouse. Mm -hmm. And I and, and uh, I live in the, in, the, in, the, in the dining room. The... Dining, dining room. room. I mean, I dine there, so I mean, I guess I guess it counts. But I'm right next to like the laundry machines, and I'm and like I have no door. Did you just really just say, "Well, I dine there," so I get I fucking hate you. <laughs> <laughs> dude, you're, you're so. Dude, his face was like, "I'm gonna fucking kill this bitch." I like, fucking well, hate him. This must be the last episode. This is it. <laughs> Johnson Possum's heads here. <laughs> who, uh, who lit this candle? The goat. Son of a bitch. Maybe he's romantic. Oh. Oh. No, this is good. Man, it's like tight. Woo! Oh, no, you did it. <laughs> Woo! Uh, I, I don't want to. I don't. I don't. I get in the hole. I don't. Get in there. I don't. Go. It's son of a bitch. Ow, you poked me. <laughs> oh, Next time I draw some possum. I love you guys. They're okay. <laughs> we got like really close. <laughs> we had the space of like, yeah. I did that. They're really just alright. So now, no. yeah, you even know. Addiction is oh. one true constant. <laughs> even though I wake in false dawns, I'm addicted to the goat. Changing, and flowing, and constantly through my tears. This is just a possibility. His reaching is always upon me. 
Yeah. Can I... Just music, though. Can I... Oh. Oh. Yes. Ooh. Dude, when this game first came out, I got to this part, I was like, Oh, crap, it's a so good! <laughs> now I'm like, alright. No, they're, 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 like, they're, they're decent. Me, personally, with graphics... I'm not even gonna say decent. I think that these are good graphics. Yeah. <sighs> good um, is such a, like... A gross, like, <laughs> phrase. Oh, like, like that burp. Thank you. Oh, that was good. God, you're fucking mad. Tastes a little bit like, uh, my lunch. What was your lunch? Uh, it was like braised pork in like a cider rub. Cool, I had cereal. Fuck it. Did we kill one Great, I had cereal. <laughs> and then I also had another bowl of cereal before you came home, so and then you, that's it. How many bowls of cereal have you had today? Two. If you had one more, you'd be a cereal killer. You play. I don't want to, don't want to deal with this. <laughs> as soon as you asked, I was like, okay, you know how many I ate. What's the joke? <laughs> Did this rock is like... There's no... I was not done. Oh, alright. Yeah. This, this area reminds me a lot of, again, that area that I modeled that didn't work out and uh, caught up sleeping. Oh, it does! Like, it would have worked out if it wasn't trying to be a live-action thing. <laughs> But it was, so... I enjoyed, fail. I enjoyed that you tried, though. Like, that was... It was interesting that someone actually tried that. You know? it tried and failed. Well, you know... It's still it's still good, though. Those who don't venture are lost. A lot of people in, in you know, this, this classmate fandom, from what I can tell, don't like that part, but I like it, actually. It's actually kind of right down the middle. Really? Like, yeah. I, I actually, because I'm not really a fan, but whenever I see that part, I'm like, oh, that's kind of cool. See, I hate it only because it's such a colossal failure to what I was trying to do. It's, ooh, fucking fuck. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't mean to. No, you're good. This is sexy. But yeah, it's like, it's straight down the middle. People who love it or hate it. There's no in between, though. Yeah. I like it. Like, nobody's ever just like, ah, I think it's okay. <laughs> they're, they're just like, chum food! Or, wow. <laughs> it's gay. It's that's cool. I think there might be an artist on that team. I don't think. I think there might be an artist. I don't think that's a stock asset. I I think that someone made that. They made it poorly, but I think they did. <laughs> Dude, I can't wait to play some of the games that you've worked on on here. Oh my god, that's gonna be fucking. Fun. I can't wait to play uh, in my father's house on here. Uh, uh, name drop. <laughs> Bam, <laughs> monies come out in three years. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> If no one knows who work on games, sometimes. Sometimes. It's one of the things. God, I haven't bought Tana... I'm also getting into homebrew games. Home? Like, homebrew. like making um, games for, like, the NES. You can do that? Oh, yeah. Ooh. I'm, I'm looking into... Um, I, okay, so I guess this is where we'll announce this. I'm not going to talk anymore about it, but oh. we'll talk about it. I like announcing stuff on this show, because it's, like, so it's stupid, and it's like, wait, you do what? Because psychological horror wasn't really a thing in games, or at least it wasn't... Well, okay, just stab me if you don't... Don't stab me. <laughs> anyway, I want to take what we know about psychological horror in games and see how far we can push an NES cartridge game in that vein. Huh. Like, imagine if somebody handed you a cartridge and they were like, hey, you like uh, you like playing old school games, right? And they're like, yeah. So you hand them this game, and then when you put it in, it's literally literally like you're playing a creepypasta. Not like Sonic EXE. No. <laughs> I remember when I first showed you that, you were like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> like, how dare they? <laughs> that being said, I do plan on owning a Genesis copy of Sonic EXE, it, just so I can put it with the collection. You fucker. I have to. I know. <laughs> this place is so beautiful. Not the. <clears throat> no, you're cool. Here, go on. Uh, that was basically. Oh, okay. it. No, I, I wanna. I just wanna. Oh. It's fun what people do with homebrew games. It's really cool. Because you're limited to what the technology can do, but your our our knowledge to ha of like how to make games is so much more vast now. Oh than yeah. It was then. So it's really cool to see what people come well, up. Because the thing about the NES era is that it wasn't about scaring you; it was about a challenge. Yeah. It was about, okay, you only have, like, five games. So, and let me be clear about something, too. I'm not stating that, um, like, yes, it's interesting to make old-school-looking games. Like, I've just old, old, like, 8-bit games that are new. That's awesome, and I, I love it. But there's something extra special to me about making it so that it works on the console. 
Because oh, yeah. because then you are you are stuck. You are limited. You can't just do whatever. You know. Yeah. And tying your hands like that, I feel like it could make some really creative stuff happen. I. Well, since this is the first time I've ever heard you talk about this, I want to help. <laughs> um, I, I already figured, yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I got to pee now. This is actually before you got here, so, bitch, what Come up? Come on, man. You gotta go, Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi, man. Sorry, this is so stupid. So rude. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I don't have to go anymore. All right. It's so warm. What's so that? warm. So, by the way, also the mic's farther away than usual, so Mike was just like, I can't. Oh, there he goes. I missed you guys. I love you all. Okay. Yeah, you're all right. Hey, what are you doing over there? Um, I, I was just checking the mail. Yeah. I got a loot crate. Oh, you did, actually. Yeah. You should open it. I'm later. No, you should do it, like, right now. I'm going to open contents. it. Okay. Well, okay. This is gonna be fun, guys. Uh, Sell uh, spare. I'm trying to reach it without unplugging the headphones. Oh, I forgot about that. Sal, Mr. Producer over here. I don't know if I can get through it all before the episode's over. Where is a knife? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I need to open it. Oh my god. What have you done? Oh my god. <laughs> Damn it. I don't just use the battery. Snap! Ow! Oh, fuck! They hit my hand! Did you really hit his hand? He just cut his hand! I'm not even joking! It's not funny! It's kind of funny. <laughs> oh my god! Is there a scar? <laughs> I want to take a picture of it. Show the audience. No, there's no scar. It just hurts. <laughs> Fucking prick. What kind of battery is this? Can't open a box. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> I just the blurriest picture on history. Fucking paparazzi. Ah. Okay. Okay. I did okay. it. I got it. Okay. I did it. Okay. I did it. Okay. I did it. Okay. I did it. I'll get it. This episode will be a little longer. I don't care. No, I think we should just end it and then we'll continue the unboxing in the next one. So if uh, like, we, have like, we have like two more minutes. Though. Yeah. So if I don't manage to open it in the next two minutes, <laughs> then they're gonna have to wait. It's <laughs> so, yeah, it's fine. I just oh, there's nothing. Okay. Yeah, just, right. So, um, it's a box. <laughs> It's mo- it's mostly black. There's one of those things that you can scan on the back a with Q- your fancy iPhone. A QR thing? Yeah. QR scan. Is that what it's called? Yeah, there yeah. you go. You can and scan that. It says, um, no, there is there is a graphic of a crate on it. You're such a fucking... Very, <laughs> very minimalist. You're the worst right? fucking person. It says, loot crate on the top. On <laughs> all the sides. <laughs> oh no, is that blued? <laughs> <laughs> blued. Um, it's Blued Street. On on the bottom, there are various barcodes. Many barcodes. Uh, there's an S. I assume <laughs> that means that this is a small box. <laughs> I, I think that's a thing. It says it says nine eight three R eleven nine eight two zero four. Um, I don't know what the fuck I have it, so, um, it says it is shipped from not a zip code Loot Crate INC, <laughs> that's incorporated. This fucking shit. 5630 Rickenbacker Road, Bell, California. I've been there. 90201. Yeah. Yeah, that's nice. Um, Oh, what's it say under the sticker, though? I gotta get under the sticker to read this. Can you open the It says box? address service requested. I don't know what that means. It says ship to bleep 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 b
I'm gonna do another sync. One, two, three. 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 Welcome back to Just. All right, we're opening this box. Hey, Pokemon. I see. Keep playing while well, I right, look at this. All right. There's a Pikachu hat. Oh, that's adorable. It is adorable. I'm gonna put it on my head. Oh. I feel I feel right in this. You feel right. There is. I think this is an Avatar rock. What is this? I don't know. I can't see. No, this it's, is it's Hearthstone. 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 Ah! Yeah. It's because I've been playing a lot of WoW lately, so I kind of know. Is it thing. a stress ball? It's a stress ball. That's me every time I fucking play WoW. Like, oh god! Oh, 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 oh. Shit! One more minute! So okay, there's I'm a cool down. stress ball that's pretty neato. I like that. That's this cool. looks like Homer Simpson. It is. Is this a Homer Simpson Buddha? Oh, I, that is the best. I think this is a Homer Simpson Buddha. If the caves are my oh. guts, oh. this must be the place where the stones are. Seriously, the music, dude. The bacteria phosphoresce and rise, singing through the tunnels. Everything here is bound by the rise and fall of the tide. That's not Homer Simpson. <laughs> That's a bag. <laughs> I can't. I can't open it. <laughs> I like how Lucrate is just like a constant Christmas. Oh, damn, son. That is, a, that is he's sitting on a donut. That is fucking That crazy. is brilliant. Hey, Mike, should we go left, right, or forward? Left. Yep, yeah? okay. I always make the wrong choice, so I don't go right. <laughs> <laughs> um, we have a supernatural car. Oh, the, um... The car. Yeah, the... From Supernatural. The, um... I don't know what... Impala! Did it! There you go. Good at it. I watched, I watched six seasons, and I know that, I know that thing. <laughs> Um, we have... Oh, what is that? Face it towards me. There's always room for... Where are my balls? We're not good at things. Scratch off gently with coin. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> what is that? Look at the pamphlet. See what the fuck that's supposed okay, to be. Okay, alright. The God. pamphlet, by the way, looks badass. Oh my god, that's fucking cool. Oh! It... I guess it has to do with these. Oh, they're like cards. Yeah. They're little cute cards. Man, Lucre, you're in trip. Oh, water. One of them is the devil. Thanks, the devil. Oh, they're loot crate cards, specifically. Like, look at the back. Oh, duh. Yeah, so, so, left, so, dumb. so left was wrong, by the way. Oh, man. Whoa! <laughs> the game just broke. Can I do it again? <laughs> Can I do it again? Oh, thanks! <laughs> That's funny. Oh, again. Hey, Chinese room, um, you have a bug about right here-ish. Like, what's going on, guys? This, I mean, I know this game's really old, but fix it. It's not really old, I guess. It's not. Oh, hey, more buckets and more writings. What the heck are you? I'm so not. Ooh, crystals! <laughs> Great commentary, Sal. Can you just keep going with that? This coin. Oh, it's a coin! Yeah. It's fucking cool. I'm gonna scratch it. Let's see if I'm a winner. I'm never a winner. Oh, it's, a, it's Lucre sent you a fucking scratch off that gave you a fucking coin to scratch off the yeah, thing man. with. Oh, I gotta go online and fucking do shit. Oh, fine. No, uh, last Lucre, I I got had like Brawl Hollow. You have to say okay, I got free game with the characters. How was that? I never played it. I don't, my computer can't handle that shit. Uh. All right, well, cool. That was good. The joke was great, Sal. You know, that was that was a joke. <laughs> Pikachu hat, and it's like bobbing gently in the wind as he turned, and he was like, what? <laughs> what do you mean doofy, by the way? I'm sorry. <laughs> this is my crown. Oh my god, in the end of the Pokemon! Yeah, this is a crown for a king. <laughs> crown for <full> king. <laughs> sorry, I've been reading uh, Storm of Swords. I knew there would be a Pokemon thing in there, but I didn't know what it would be. I have to get rid of all my old loot crate boxes. They're just getting in the way. No, dude. Actually, I like I like loot crate boxes because they're small and they put a lot of shit in. If you want them, you can have some of them. I might. Or I'll store them in the closet. Yeah, that's that's good. That's what I'm doing after we're done recording. I'm reshaping this room so I have a workstation so I can actually edit Jossum Possum. Hey, that's you guys. Yeah. Well, no, yeah. that's us. They they're just watching. They're voyeurs. <laughs> <laughs> 
discussed. <laughs> hey, Mike, when when was the time that we started the episode? Um, it'll be done. I know when it is. Okay, thanks. <laughs> I totally missed it. Yeah, I was I, too. I, I was too busy being amazed tackling. by the stupidity that was going on. I'm just gonna take a sip of my drink. Oh, oh the current pull me. You know this po- this Pikachu hat is gonna end up going on our big Pikachu, so it's like he's wearing his own kin skin. See, Mike, what do I do things like that? <laughs> does he have ears? Oh, he does. Yeah. Dude, I'm so jealous of that Hearthstone. <laughs> It's so cute. Yeah, um... I need I, all the stress balls I can take at work. <laughs> so, um... <coughs> so, I'll talk about it. I got... I, got, I haven't talked about the... I haven't talked about the Disney pitch. No. That, that happened in between episodes. So, I was offered to pitch the thing to Disney for Disney <coughs> to me. And ultimately, I decided not to do it, but in my deciding, I was I got into this weird depressive state because I couldn't fucking think. So I just played WoW for three days fucking straight and leveled up a character um, a character to level 20 because it was I had a starter account. I'm not paying for that shit. Damn. And I leveled another one up to 15. Well, there goes our Blizzard sponsorship. No, come back. No, no they just took... No. There goes the computer that they gave us. <laughs> no, I'm actually going to pay for WoW once I get into my... Oh. oh, don't try and save it now. You can't fix this. You you broke up... Dude, you can't stand outside with the with the stereo over your head. Just... I'm trying to suck, Mike. I didn't movie <laughs> he denied with the ferocity <laughs> <laughs> you you are not <laughs> whoa oh man you okay this is weird that is weird this is fucking nasty it's like going well, I lost a, where I was. it's like we're inside a golem's bowels that also is the correct way to go let's not go that way no, let's try it that might be actually I don't know was it Oh, are you thinking because it looks like the right way, it won't be? Oh. Uh, yeah, Do you think no. they're fucking with you? Yeah. No, but... Um, I mean, messing with you? So, while I was depressed, I played a lot of WoW, and so now I'm really into WoW. Isn't that true of anybody who plays WoW? Yeah. <laughs> when I was depressed, I played a lot... Oh, that's so mean. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> no, I, I wasn't so much making fun of you as much as I was making fun of everyone who plays WoW. So, me? Uh, there goes our, uh, all our fans. Yeah, man. <laughs> no, but, We um, have no fans. Not yet. We haven't uploaded anything. I know. That's it. But, If um, you're listening now... That's weird. Hi. I'm wearing a Pikachu hat. What's down here? Nothing. You know what's not down there? Like my future. Air. <laughs> you just go up and throw your hair back like Ariel. Yeah, man. So, when I was in preschool, I used to get in trouble a lot because I was a little shit. <laughs> and um, so they used to sit me time out a lot. But the, see, the thing is, the time out spot was right below the poster of oh, um, wait, Little Behold Mermaid. Damascus taken. Okay, that's gross. <laughs> so, oh, this is the plot hallway. Cool. The time out spot was right below the post. This huge poster of the Little Mermaid. So I would just get in trouble. Then I'd just gawk at Ariel because, you know, she pretty. Is she pretty? She smells a little bit like a fish, but, you know. Just a little bit. Is that racist? Damascus. Oh, Damascus is taken. Behold, Damascus is taken. Okay, that's what it says. <laughs> racist? <laughs> Against fish people? Oh, okay. Like fish women? Amphibian? And fish men? And fish siblings and uncles? Mm-hmm. We just call them mermaids and mermen, but, you know. Use the incorrect word. That's their word, so... I'm not going to try it on them. I don't want the war to restart. <laughs> the war? <laughs> well, wait. Away from being a city? What? Or, or, um, uh, uh, away says, from being a city, yeah. Huh. And it's... You know what the unfortunate thing is, Sal? I find that I'm incapable of fully enjoying this game because since it came out, these games have begun to flood the market. Tell me fucking about it. So, like, since I didn't play it when you did, when it came out, yeah, when I, I find it, out. like, I'm, I can't really invest because my mind doesn't want to like this. Yeah. <laughs> no, um, on a stream... It sucks. I don't know if you saw the stream I did of uh, this game called Ether 1. 
It's I, I I think I've heard of it. I it's, it tried to be this game, but a it, lot of but also it was like yeah, but it has to have gameplay elements, so we'll have them collect stuff and do puzzles. And I'm like, that's not. See, I don't think that a walking simulator, and I don't use that as a dirty word. It's what it is. Yeah, has to have gaming elements to be an, an enriching experience, but it has to have something to invest in. And most of them don't seem to. Oh yeah, no, definitely. Because this game actually has like a nice plot and story, but other games try to emulate other things. And, and I'm sure we'll play more of them. Oh yeah. I want to actually, uh, Joss and Possum, uh, everyone's gone to the rapture, because there's some shit I have to say about that game. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what that is. <laughs> I think I'm going to definitely, it'll be a big talking point in a Jabber Jossum about it. Oh yeah, a Jabber Jossum. I, I, I don't know if yet I'm going to do a Jabber Jossum about, like, every single one of them, or just the, um, just like the genre as a whole. Yeah. What, what, why are you like looking like you have to fart really bad? My stomach hurts. Oh, yeah, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. I forgot. Um, so last night, I, I was really hungry, and Brooke was like... Oh, this sounds like a bad story. <laughs> and Brooke's like... Well, I'm oh, next time I draw some possum! Oh, uh, well, they'll have to wait two days to hear that story. Yeah, man. Sucks to be... Better be a doozy. Well, wait, this is... No, there's a plot happening. Is this... We can't stop it? Next time I draw some possum... Everyone's like, shit! <laughs> We did. Yeah, I'm wearing a Pikachu hat. Jossum Possum! Jossum Possum. So we left off last episode on a bit of a cliffhanger. So, oh, there's the car, and then... You can't hang off a cliff if you're underwater. Mm-hmm. Okay. So actually, this whole stretch of road, you can find on Google Maps. That's awesome. Yeah. Like, a couple of fans did it once, and I was like, are you fucking serious? <laughs> <laughs> but, oh yeah, my stomach. Um... So I like that you tell the story about your stomach when it sounds like we are in a stomach. Yeah, but actually, let's not talk about that for a moment. Let's talk about the plot here. So this is... All right. So, yeah. So I know it's been a while for us since we played it, but you kind of remember the things that were said about cars yeah. and... All right. So this is sort of telling. I love this. I like that lights are still on. I love how, like, you just come to the scene of the crime. Mm-hmm. In this weird, like, odd state of being... It's a dangerous thing about uh, being innov- innovative is uh, if you make something like this and people love it, wait for the copycats that don't respect why it was great. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Slender! <laughs> <laughs> we just sit. Hell, fucking... It, these guys do that a lot, though. I mean, there's tons of people who try and emulate a machine for pigs... And yeah. their games aren't very good. I haven't played a machine for big, so I And might, we will. But um my understanding of it is that it is pretty good. I heard opposite actually. Oh my. I also assumed that it was pretty good because so many people are trying to emulate what I know are things that were at least made re popular by it. Yeah. Oh, but on my stomach, so Brooke made like dinner, she made um chicken. Mm-hmm. Not the shirt fit all the way. It's so like. Welcome to eating lunch at my job. The ta- Ooh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so yeah, my whole night was me being like, uh. And then while I was laying in the bed. That's what I get for working in Nintendo. Am I right? <laughs> oh. No, I'm kidding. Yeah. I, work in Nintendo. <laughs> I, I did. I so did too. But yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but <that's, laughs> they yeah. never gave me food poisoning. Oh, they, they just gave me shit benefits. <laughs> did Nintendo have good food, dude. Cafe Mario. Yeah, was no, nice. they had great food that was very expensive. Yeah, it was really. Mm. <laughs> I, I would drop like five. See, the job I have right now, it's free food, so I really don't have much right to complain. Yeah. If I start vomiting on my desk, I still have to say thank you. It's fair, and I do. <laughs> Dude, but Nintendo's food is so good. No, yeah, uh, man. Dude, I remember I would always like pass by the. Uh, there's always this, this uh, chef. Now, to be fair, we didn't really work for Nintendo. Let's let's. 
Oh, yeah, let's we, also we, preface We that. were on the phones. Yeah, like, we were customer service at Nintendo through staffing agencies. So, yeah. it's not exactly the same. I know, because you say we work on games, and they hear Nintendo, they're like, Whoa! What? I think they created Mario's! We made Mario! No, we made Mario's. It's Mario's, like, wait, wait, wait. copyright breaking. No, 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 it is. You know how, like, Kirby has, like, yarn stuff? Mario, but with Oreos. You know what we need to draw some possum once I get it? Yeah. It's on the list. Oh, there are two things. Okay. So, uh, there are two homebrews I'm going to be getting uh, that I want to draw some possum once we get capture equipment that works right. By the way, we're in the last stage of the game. Okay. Should I, or should I not? No, talk? keep going. Okay. So, one of them is called uh, uh, Super Mario Fantasy, right? Hmm. And it's Mario characters in an 8-bit game on a cartridge for your NES, right? Yeah. In the style of the original Final Fantasy game. Huh. Right? Then there's also, I really want to play fucking Dr. Mario World, which is like Super Mario World, but you're Dr. Mario. Oh my god. Curing the pathogens! Actually, the, <laughs> the amount of homebrews that I want to play on this silly little show is growing exponentially. We would have had so much to debate. They'll did eventually learn that I'm the big retro geek. Who left the pot yeah, it's not me. Yeah. Who formed the I, I'm only geek about late sunny. 90s, early 2000s RPGs, and that's about water. it. That's like the, that's the extent. I love um, early did retro gaming. I love it. No, obviously, you know, I love modern gaming, too. Yeah, me too. Um, but uh, what I was going to say is, I would always pass the chef, and he's always like, hey, what's up? Who? The chef at Nintendo. Oh! <laughs> I was then, like, did I completely miss a part of this well, game? Well, no, you cut me off to say your dumb shit, but it's fine. <laughs> your face is like, you wound me with your words, sir. Okay, yeah. How do you get up there? <laughs> <laughs> That's impossible. But, um, then also the cashier, uh, whenever I would pass by her, for some reason she thought, like, because I'm Italian, so technically I'm, I'm, I'm Latino, technically, but I'm not Hispanic. Mm-hmm. But she thought I was Hispanic, so she would always like speak Spanish to me, and I would kind of laugh and just take my food and, as if I was awkward, which I was. But I just didn't know what she was saying. <laughs> Why didn't you just say I don't speak Spanish, dude? Did you don't understand? I, I do understand. <laughs> Shit! Oh, I think I died. Oh. Way way to go! Come back. Oh. Runs right this fuck back in. We fucking have to play on this game is actual sunlight. That's a fucking mess your brain up game. What? Actual sunlight. What is that? It's a indie game. Um, it's all about depression. That's all I'll tell you. Like huh. telling you anything else is ruining it. Actually, okay. I don't know if it if it will make a good luck. It's one of those games. If nothing else, it's something that I need to talk about in some venue. Dude, I was surprised that this Let's Play is actually turning out well, because when I first brought this up in my head, I was like, I don't think the rest of work. There's too much of talking. And well, we realized... don't know if it works yet. We have to wait and see how many people in the comments are like, you suck! It's all of them. This is one guy said, I thought they were okay. <laughs> 20 <laughs> billion dislikes to that comment. <laughs> Deleted their account. They were getting death threats. I don't know why, but the way you said that sound like Max Land. It's like twenty billion. Because <laughs> the way that guy fucking talks, I love Max Land. Hey, I both love him and I want to murder him because of extreme jealousy. Yeah. Okay, but okay, here we go. First time I think we've done this. Hey, Max Landis, you should come on the show. Bring him on. If, if by some miracle Max Landis is watching this show <laughs> join us then yes join us be one of us he tweeted me back once <laughs> a sentence what do you say stop <laughs> Find you, and I will kill you. 
I said, I got the pictures show to Disney soon. You really helped me out with your pictures online. And I really admire you. Next time on Jawsome. <laughs> Mike finds a new co-host. <laughs> <laughs> and then everyone he asks is like, no. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you think this isn't going to be the episode? I'm not going to cut it till I stop laughing. <laughs> Just stop. From joy, from sad. <laughs> oh, oh, we have fun. Anyway, seriously, Max, let us come on the show. Yeah, no, yeah, no, yeah, no that'd, be awesome. be, yeah. that'd be fucking sick. <laughs> <laughs> fucking <with> you. <laughs> Such a dick. Just ten, like what was it? Three minutes of just laugh. I'm sorry, that was just so <laughs> your face. You were just like. <laughs> like well fuck you chump <laughs> but it's so much better I mean <laughs> because <laughs> imagine if you were excited to tell that story he tweeted me back once I was like hey I'm doing this thing and he was like give up <laughs> <laughs> son of a bitch <laughs> oh, whew. Oh. Oh. I like how I was so embarrassed to end the episode early I was like yeah I'm gonna do this <laughs> I quit here's my resume <laughs> Resignation. Bye. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm sorry if that was bad. I, I was just... Whew, oh, I that was you. good. Uh, you know I love you. Yeah. Uh, I joke out of love. Yeah, Unless it's to the audience. I hate them. Yes. You know words hurt, right? What? You know words hurt? <laughs> oh, I'm preparing for the cold street that you'll eventually be living on. <laughs> You know what will make you feel better? The only way that I can say things like that to you is if I imagine I'm saying them to me. Aww. <laughs> like, I, when I was making that last joke, I was thinking about talking to myself. And that's why I, was, I tried to say it to you the first time, and I was just like, I can't. That's so sad. <laughs> I was like, yeah, but I can make fun of myself. Fuck you. <laughs> Oh, and the Jossum Possum. Jossum Possum. So you know what's funny? This was originally a Half-Life 2 mod. I told you that, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, that's kind of neato. That's cute. Hey, so welcome back. All right, so I'll give um, Sal some bragging rights. Since last time, I just, like, crushed his uh, self-esteem. <laughs> yeah. With my waffle booted boot. I thought I was saying what I thought. <laughs> and then you're like, yeah, I crushed it with, with my waffle penis. And I was like, what the fuck? What's a waffle penis? You tell me. It doesn't sound good. Doesn't sound like something to brag about. <laughs> it doesn't sound good. Sounds like a bad thing. No, but, um... I'm gonna check down down here. Oh, whoops. Anybody who's uh, heard of Freeman's Mind, uh, Sal has worked with that guy. Oh, yeah! Ross Scott! So, I'll give you a little, a little props. Dude, he's cool. He's a cool guy. Yeah, he is. I like him. Yeah, he's in, um... 
the season of Pablo Hall that hasn't been released. He's in like. Oh man, I spoiled it. Whoops, no, dude, I fucking. I announced that shit like so long ago. Oh, okay. <laughs> not to this. I almost said not to this large of an audience, but I have no idea how many people are fucking subscribed to us. Like, by the time this comes out, it could be like five. <laughs> To this humongous audience, and, and it's like three guys in a room, like yeah, yeah, we're we're important. Yay. They talk directly to me, Josh. Josh, the viewer. Josh is like, oh my god, holy shit, he fucking knows, and they're making fun of me. <laughs> well, no one's gone. I'm gonna find him. <laughs> he comes like that song, "Stand" by Eminem. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> You know, it's funny when I heard that um, Diane Antwer was inspired by them. There's there's a song, I think, um, that Max Normal does that is like Stan. Oh, yeah. And I was like, yeah, okay. <laughs> by the way, guys, Mike got me into rap. Yeah. I'm now. <laughs> Nothing good came. Oh. Hip. You're there a jive. You you're from the street now. Can I say that? You could say what? That you're jive? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I don't know what's racist anymore. Why would part. Jive be racist? Dude, thinking that Jive is racist is more racist than Jive is. <laughs> I, was, I was about to put, pull a, um, have you ever seen the, uh, you probably haven't, what? but uh, the commentary Do to you Lemony see? Snicket's... I find no. each step harder and heavier. I drag Donnelly's corpse on my back across these rocks, and all I hear are his whispers of guilt, his reminders, his burnt letters, his neatly folded clothes. He tells me I was not drunk at all. I don't know. Didn't you start this whole thing with yeah, a drink? Yeah, yeah. But, okay, so on the commentary, it's, a, it's the director and Lemony Snicket. Mm-hmm. And um, the director's like, oh, Sergio the Entertainer here to give us some urban flair. Oh, and Lemony yeah. Snicket's like, urban flair? You know... I'm from the city. Do I not give it urban flair for you? <laughs> He's like, I, I, mm, uh. dude, seriously. The the urban market is one of the most pretentious statements. Urban, urban. fucking the whole phrase urban. It's like, you fuck, shut up. Well, it's 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 like a piss poor attempt to be PC. Yeah, and it's insult more insulting than what you really are trying to say. <laughs> Did you just admit it? You're racist. Yeah, either admit it or change. <laughs> You know, don't treat me like an idiot. I'm not a Donald Trump supporter. It's not going to work out. Yeah, fuck Trump. You're fired. You're fired. <laughs> not to talk about um, politics on Joss and Boston, but fuck Donald Trump. So how do you feel about abortion? Legitimately? No. Okay. No. <laughs> not to say. We can get into some shit. Oh, what's... Oh, the car? Legitimately. <laughs> I thought you were asking a serious question. I was going to give you a serious answer. I'm sorry I respect your thoughts and, and like feelings in the... I, <laughs> whatever. I, I'm not quite ready to talk about those deep... That, yeah, we, that deep of issue quite No, yet. guys, we will get deep. Not now. Yeah, not, not yet. Not when the only subscriber we have is Josh. <laughs> Josh, like, I'm not good enough, am I? Josh, come on. All right, you're Dude, adequate. Dude, <laughs> like, you're, C average. You C minus, maybe. You're just pissing off him, off Josh. Josh, now. it's okay. Like, Is Josh now a viewer? Just, Is that like a crow, too? Josh, you just need to exercise the eraser more. Like, fix your mistakes. Oh, well, I was like, eraser? <laughs> what are you talking about? You fucking weirdo. <laughs> what are you doing? No, um, Josh, he'll be okay. Yeah? I don't fucking care. <laughs> I imagine a panel five years from now. Josh comes up, we're signing shit, and he's like, hey, how are you? And he's like, hey, my name is Josh. I'm like, okay, cool, because we forgot about this show, because so we have to Make it out to Josh. And then, um, and I'm like, oh, cool, cool, and I sign it, and he goes to you, and he's like, hey. And you're like, oh, yeah, Josh? And he's like, yeah. And he's like, oh, cool, here we go. You look up. Barrel writes your fucking temple. I'm gonna be the first time. What? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Again, Mike, not too deep. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> They're like, wait, what? <laughs> I've been shot at a lot, actually, in my lifetime. Yeah. Dude, okay, just go into it. Like, I don't care anymore. No, I, I, let, let's let him sit on it. Let's let him wait. We'll tell him one day. Dude, I would hate that. I know. If someone starts to start that story and they just didn't follow what up. What story? Which one? <laughs> You're making it worse. 
So you're just making it so much worse. I would never do that. I am a kind host. In my head, time so then you were like, I'm a kind ho. Well, you're not wrong. <laughs> <laughs> That's why it was so funny. I am a kind ho. There were chemical stains on the tarmac. It's a tarmac. Air conditioning, brake fluid, and petrol. He kept sniffing at his fingers as he sat by the roadside, waiting mm. as if he couldn't quite understand or recognize their smell. He said he'd been traveling back from a sales mm. conference in Exeter. He'd stopped for farewell drinks earlier, but had kept a careful eye on his intake. You could hear the sure. sirens above the idling traffic. Oh no, stop by a rock. I'm just, eh, stop by a rock! And you're to blame! You give to the I messed it up. I messed it up. I fucked up. I fucked up. I messed it up. So guys, I can't fix this. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> There's no glue that can put this back together. Not even Elmer. I eat all the Elmer's glue. God damn it, Mike. We talked about this. Sniffed all the airplane glue, <laughs> and I used all the gray paper and crafting glue to make you a present. Oh yay! Yeah. <laughs> Can I have it? <laughs> I might be a little bit tired. Yeah, I might be a little bit tired. It's stuffy. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm sorry, Josh. Oh yeah, Josh. You forgot about Josh, and he's shooting me in the head? This isn't make fun of Josh. From here, I can see my armada. No, I fuck Josh. I collected all the letters. I got out with you. I'm not fuck Josh. He's if I'd have ever made it to the mainland, but had instead collected <laughs> at the bottom of my rucksack, and I spread them out along the lost beach. Then I took each and every one, and I folded them into boats. I folded okay. you into the creases, and then, as the sun was setting, I set the fleet to sail, shattered right. into 21 pieces. I consigned you to the Atlantic, and I sat here until I'd watched all of you sink. Are you sure that those are boats, sir? Because they look like hats to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mike! <laughs> oh, no. I thought that was one of these boats that you can actually set off. I think that teenage goth poets must love this game. Yeah. Like it I seems didn't... like it's that's kind of the. I did not know where the fuck you were going. Kind of the kind second. of the tone, like that. I don't know that pretentious, over the top. Uh, uh, on a sudden, a light from heaven shone around him. And he fell to the ground. What the fuck that means? <laughs> Cue all the comments telling us that we're stupid because we don't appreciate Dear Esther. I appreciate it. I know, but uh, dude, you don't have to. It doesn't have to be true to get comments about it. It's true. <laughs> Before you comment that I don't like this game, I fucking love this game. It's artsy as fuck, but I love it. Like it's pretentious, but I love it. Cue the comments that say that you don't really understand it, so you can't love it. Dude, I'm gonna fucking punch you. <laughs> I'm gonna punch you next time on Joss and Boss. I mean, put a pillow over my face. I would never punch him. Have we not talked about that I'm a pacifist? Yeah. Have no. We? No. You lied. <laughs> <laughs> So, um, oh, what the fuck's that? Ah! It flaked in me! It's fucking Sauron. I see you. But, so, I'm a pacifist. I was gonna talk about that. <laughs> <laughs> Pictured Sauron saying, like, the little eye just going, well, I, thought, I, thought, I thought it was funny because, like, we took a break, went downstairs, had a drink, you know. 
And you're just like, wait, what? We're still on that. We're still on that. All right, talk talk about it. I don't know. It's that. Oh, that was it. I don't like hurting people. Uh, but okay, so you did it I was just saying this earlier, but I never got the chance to. So apparently, um, so in in my room, there's a window into the kitchen, and there's no actual door. So anyone just kind of walk portal. in and out. No, that's what it's called. Oh, okay. Portal. I mean, an asshole. Sorry. <laughs> that's not really. Um, when Paul keeled over dead, surprising because I'm often an asshole. By hitting him in the chest Are you? Stones hey, you know. <laughs> come on. He was lifeless for 21 minutes. <laughs> Certainly he long counted. enough for the oxygen levels in his brain to have decreased and caused hallucinations and delusions of transcendence. Huh. Oh. Hallucinations. I'm right. running out of painkillers, and the moon has become almost unbearably bright. Sure. But, um... Right, weirdo. But the entire day, I, I, I stopped him from, uh, basically going in through the, the portal, so I put up you curtains. You didn't say who him was. Oh, Jazz. Yeah, but they don't know who Jazz is. The cat. There you go. Fucking idiot. <laughs> They might think that you're talking about the musical movement. Jazz, our, our cat. Put up images, Mike. <laughs> there, I made you do some work. <laughs> they were great images, too. Yeah, too, yeah. Um, yeah, put up that one vine of him in the box. So kiwaii. I haven't seen that one. Really? Yeah. Okay, whatever. Well, you won't need this. <laughs> <laughs> huh. It's do you see him? Yeah. A friend over there. He's gonna, like, do the poof thing again? Oh, kinda. I don't know why it's not poofing this. He didn't want us to see him. So they're making him... Oh, we're, we're the closer we're getting, he's going... He's kind of fading out. But, uh, and so basically... This is the finale, actually. The finale? This is the finale. Alright. Why would we take a break at the... <laughs> we're gonna just look at, like, a five-minute break, and... Uh, whatever. But yeah, so, so Jazz, um, he was very mad at me. I was moving everything around. I wouldn't let him into my room. Because he looked at, go, looked at the walk over the um, the window. Mm -hmm. And I was like, I hate that. Because it knocked over my shit. Yeah. So, as I was going to bed... I've begun my voyage he... in a paper boat. <laughs> I will fly to Paul the moon. just pushes you out of the way. Basically, he shat on my, on my blanket. Are you serious? It's <laughs> like, oh, really? You want to keep me out? Keep this out. <laughs> So, I just sleep with, like, nothing. It's like, you want to play with me like a good dad? Fine, let's play catch. <laughs> Shit's on your bed. If that cat ever shits in my room, I will clean it up and take him out of my room. We will come together. That's what I did. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, Maya, take him? I don't want any more. Because Jazz is always down there with me, and we're always playing around and chilling. But, oh, man, that was so annoying. I was like, fuck you, dude. How dare you? I'm so nice to you. I spoil you. I pick you up. I pick and then, you up. meanwhile, my room is, like, Eden to that cat, because he never gets to come in here. Oh, yeah. Well, you, because you have a door. Yeah. I'm so jealous of the door. Whoa. What if I just... No. Don't. Don't. This isn't King's Quest. <laughs> dude, that fucking cliff, man. <laughs> and he was... And he was produced. Can you read that? And he was. Yeah, I think he's producing something. Uh, journey. Oh, proceeding on his journey. He was oh. proceeding on his journey. Did it. There you go. Good at it. First Sweet. try. Gold stars. Gold. Confetti! Fwee! I was thinking that it was. Yeah! <laughs> Oh, we did it! I'm so jealous. Somebody at work put up a um, a celebrate poster from Five Nights. Oh, uh, I mean the game we haven't finished yet. So, uh, I'm scared. <laughs> <clears throat> um. All right, let's actually walk through this. So, and it was, it was coming near to Damascus. Okay. So as he was proceeding on his journey and coming near to Damascus. Mm -hmm. All right, choir. That's what it sounds like when I poop. Yeah. Nah. My poop song is the Peepers Court theme. Oh yeah. If only Dom dum, had experienced dum. this, he would have realized he was his own. Dum 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 dum. 
remember because when, I am becoming this when you came to me and so you were like, what's your poop song? And I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? And it was like, dude, everyone has a poop song. Yeah, everybody has, don't. Yeah, everyone should have a poop song. Should. It's not, the not. song that, if it were possible, would play whenever you pooped. And mine is the People's Court theme. Um, my buddy Ramsey's was Danger Zone. <laughs> uh, my ex-girlfriend Olivia, uh, her um, poop song was... Uh, uh, the Terminator theme. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. That? Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm glad this is what we talked about the last episode. Oh, I think maybe... I forget what Mike's was. It was Ain't really good. Time. Oh! Mike's ah. was Ring of Fire. <laughs> <laughs> Ring of Fire. Down, down, down. I think mine would have to be when the man comes around. There are headlights oh reflected God. in his retinas. I love it. Too long in the tunnels of my island without a bottom. The sea creatures have risen to the surface, but the gulls are not here to carry them back to their nests. I've become fixed, open and staring, an eye turned on itself. I've become an infected leg whose tracking lines form a perfect map of the junctions of the M5. I will take the exit at mid-thigh and plummet to my Esther. I just like walked away. <laughs> I'm right here. It was very like conspicuous. They were just like, I'm just gonna go over here. Whoa. How the fuck did he get up there? That is that is unlikely. <laughs> like, I don't believe this. My, My immersion! <laughs> That was fucking fantastic! <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, did we just do that? Yeah, that's a thing that happened. <laughs> How do you go up there? What the fuck is this guy? Spider Man. <laughs> Plot twist. <laughs> Spider Man game. The they whole time. They released footage of uh, a prototype for the Attack on Titan game, and what was just the Tush of Spider Man 2? <laughs> and I was like, dude, come down. <laughs> I love you, Will. Dude, we need Will on here. When he comes, when he visits, we'll have to do a playthrough or something with him. I don't care what. Barbie game. See, why do you go there? What? They're the best games. With this epic music, just like... <laughs> <laughs> like we duel. <laughs> so, uh... S speaking of dueling... Actually, I should... <sighs> Should I get to a story on the, the end of the game? Sideways. The ending's right up there. The sirens fell through the middle Save distance it. and the yeah. metal moaned in grief. You guys just have to wait. I'm about this night in walking. Old bread and gull bones. Old Donnelly at the bar gripping his drink. Old Esther walking without her children. Old <laughs> Paul. Tune in. Old Paul. <laughs> yes, he too. turns off his lights alone. <laughs> oh, that is rank. I apologize. It's fine, dude. So before you came here, since my stomach was all messed up from... Did I tell the Brooke story? I did. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, we haven't, we haven't recorded in so long, and I just stored stories, just like, <laughs> of the months of what I wanted to talk about. So, before you came in here, I was just tooting like a motherfucker, and it was nasty. <laughs> I was like, he better not come home now. He's gonna fucking fire He's me. gonna thank China. He's gonna thank China. <laughs> come on, man! <laughs> I hope that we. I really hope we get that one oh. viewer who didn't see the other episode, so they don't know what I'm talking about. They're Dude. just like racism. Oh shit! I see you. Kind of looks like he has eyes, right? Oh, yeah, he's gone. Now. Oh, oh, he ain't gone. Mm -hmm. Give him a hug. Oh yeah. Yeah, I think maybe. It's, it's hard gross. to tell. I want to live here. Yeah? On this rock, I will build my castle. <laughs> and the name reads under the statue, Ozzy Mendez. <laughs> in my passing, I will send news to each and every star. Yeah. Dear Esther, oh. I have burned the cliffs of Damascus. Hands off keyboard. I have drunk deep of it. My heart is my leg and a black line etched on the paper all along this boat without a bottom. You are all the world like a nest to me. Eggs unbroken form like fossils, come together, 
send small black flowers to the air. On this infection, hope. From this island, flight. From this grief, love. This guy must send good get well cards. I'm still in a dream, snake eater. Oh my God, yes. <laughs> <laughs> What a thrill. Darkness and silence <laughs> through the night. What a fear in my heart. And you're so, so supreme. I give my love. Not for her, but for you. <laughs> oh, God, that was fantastic. Oh, I feel so good. Oh, dude. <laughs> that was fucking. By the way, Metro Gear Solid 3. Right now, Will's just like, they did it. <laughs> they did the thing! He's already, like, he, like, he already called you. He doesn't care about this Spider-Man 2 thing anymore. He's like, oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I'm fine now. <laughs> huh? Dude, we, that was so up. High five me again. That was great. <laughs> Can this episode just be called What a Thrill? Yeah. Yeah. Oh. I could fly the entire time. He had me walking around, <laughs> like, motherfucker. It was funner this way. It's <laughs> beautiful. I'm still, I'm still on the fucking snake eater. <laughs> that, that was the highlight for me. Yeah, that, was, that was good. <laughs> Dude, I, was, I did not. I was not ready for any of that. <laughs> I didn't know how much I needed in my life. Dude, so I was running Redwater, and that's a, that's a, that's a short term working on. And there's a ladder climbing scene that I kind of emulates uh, mm -hmm. that scene, and she just has a change as she climbs a ladder. Okay. And, and I listened to that song on loop. When, when that last thing just happened, it made me realize what you meant when you first saw me holding jazz when we first moved in here, and you're like. I never thought about Mike with a cat. I never realized it's something I wanted so much. <laughs> it was so adorable. <laughs> Come back. So, this black screen will not stop until you just close the game. Nice. To symbolize death is just one long black. Just... I actually really like that. That's cool. You could still hear the ocean. Because for a while, I was just sitting here when I first played the game, and I was like... Where are the credits? Credits? I want to know who made this bullshit game. So I first played it, I hated yeah. it. Yeah. So I was like... Wow, really? And then, <laughs> but now looking back, I'm like... It's so good. I like it. Yeah, because when I first played it, I was... I probably thought about this. Yeah, you did in the very beginning. Yeah. But yeah, then afterwards, it's the recollection of what just happened to me. So that was Duraster. That's, the, I think, the, the, the second or third game we've beaten on here. Yeah, something like what that. Else we we, we, we beat did Alone in the Dark. Alone in the Dark. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. I don't know what you're talking about. Perfect. Ten, you weren't playing it. <laughs> uh, we beat um, Kane's Quest. Yep, so that's very. I think that's it. Yeah. So next time on Joss and Possum, I legit don't know. Cool. <laughs> What a thrill. Darkness <laughs> and silence through the night. What a fear in my heart. And you're so supreme. I give my love. Not for all.